Welcome back to the Elder Scrolls IV Oblivion, ladies and gentlemen. Um, so we are doing this, Thylar. Fact, let me go into my active quest. Jirgorth wants, wants me to relight light the great torch of New Sheoth. I need to go to the ruins of Cylon, kindle the flat flame of A Agnon there, and return with its holy fire. Jirgorth warned me that, that golden saints and seducers will gu guard the shrine, often fight each other, but I should proceed cautiously. Um, show the map. So I am going to go here. Eat a madness because honestly, why, why not? I'm currently silenced. That's nice. fucking things I'm not repeating the same goddamn thing I did oh hello What happened to the sound? What? Hello? I don't know. I don't know, man. Where are you? Where are who? What?
Oh. Oh, I have arrived at the ruins of Cylarn. I will need to speak to the commanders of the Golden Saints and Dark Sisters to find out the light of the flame of Ivaka. Halt! Mortals are not permitted within the walls of Holy Cylarn. My pardon, Lord. Receive this key and with it free passage throughout the Shrine of the Flame of Agnon. Alas, we cannot light the flame until we take control of the Altar of Despair from the Infernal Maskin. The Armazokana would wish to speak to you at once. Proceed through this door to our main encampment at the Altar of Rapture. Cool. Oh, okay, so I'm going in here. My scouts reported no signs of the Maskin in the Underdeep. It's our best chance to take them unawares. Too risky. It's likely to be a trap. They could cut us to pieces down there if they knew we were coming. With all due respect, Armas, I ask that you reconsider. The main passage is strongly defended. Perhaps if you'd allow me to scout further. Enough! I've made my decision. We will attack down the main passage as planned. The Maskin will not withstand us. I overheard two Golden Saint officers are, are arguing about the best way to attack, attack the Stark Seducers. The Lieutenant, Muriel, mentioned something about, about the un, Underdeep, a secret side passage leading into the Dark Lair. I should find out. Okay. This is no place for a mortal. We are about to join battle against the Maskin. You'd best stand aside. Shiagora sent, um, has sent me. I need your help. My pardon, Emissary. I am at your service. We are preparing to sweep the Maskin scum from Cylarn. Perhaps Sheogorath sent you to help us. Um. Only the servants of Sheogorath can light the flame by kindling the altars of despair and rapture which feed the flame. Alas, we hold only the altar of rapture. The treacherous Maskin hold the altar of despair. We must control both to light the flame. If you help us seize the altar of despair from the Maskin, I will be honored to kindle the flame of Agnon for my lord Sheogorath. The treacherous ones, the dark seducers of ill repute, whose every action drags Sheogorath's holy name through the mud. The flame is fed from the altar of rapture and the altar of despair. Only servants of Sheogorath can kindle the altars. Once we capture the altar of despair from the Maskin, it will be my great honor to light the flame for Lord Sheogorath. The only way to assault the Altar of Despair is down the main passage between the two altars. It will be difficult. The Maskin have fortified their position, but I am confident that with your help, we can defeat them. 
Will you help us retake the Altar of Despair and drive the Maskin out of Cylarn once and for all? Ah, Meryl's beloved surprise attack. A perfect example of why males do not hold command positions. He has failed to consider the risks of his plan. If the Maskin have prepared an ambush along that route, we would be slaughtered. We're better off storming the main passage, where our superior strength and blade work can come into play. Are you ready to help us destroy the Maskin and take control of the Altar of Despair? You know what? Um, I like this. Um, you know what? Um... Yeah, sure, why not? I'll Very help you. good, Emissary. With your help, we will rid Cylarn of the Maskin once and for all. Down with the Maskin! For Shale Gorath! For for Shale Gorath. I'm just gonna let them fight, fight off. Oh, Oreo! Eight Tom 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 Oreo! Jesus Christ! Eight Tom Oreo! 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 Yeah, I, 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 I honestly think this is a bet, bet, better decision, anyways. <laughs> oh, that was awesome. They, they did half my work for me. <laughs> that was awesome. Oh, that was, that was beautiful. Death to the Maskin for the glory of Sheogorath. My soul for Sheogorath. Anyways. Yeah, they're doing all the work for me. I don't even need to do anything. <laughs> oh. Some are glitching under the wall. Move. Yeah, they're doing all the work for me. I don't even need to do anything. <laughs> this is awesome. Dun 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 Okay, I don't want to hit the saints Um. Hold on. Uh, da, 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 da. I don't even need any. I, I don't even need to do anything. Right. Bum, bum, bum. I mean, hey, I'm not going to complain. Oh, great. <laughs> it took too many arrows. <laughs> oh, let me see here. Over encumbered. Um, okay, don't need Um,
I'm over in, uh, what is over encumbering me? Hold on. What can I get? Oh, well, I can get rid of these. Because I don't need them anymore. Admit the dog commentaries. I don't need them. Where am I going? Despair is ours. Kill but the battle is not over yet. Defensive positions. I mean, hey, if it works, it works. You ladies do you. is ours. I have already selected a candidate for the honor of kindling the Altar of Rapture. I will now claim the honor of victory for myself, here on the Altar of Despair. The altars can only be kindled by the willing sacrifice of a Maskin or an Oriole. It is my great honor to release my soul to oblivion in service to Lord Sheogorath. Farewell. I will not walk these lands for many a year. The treacherous ones, the dark seducers of ill repute, whose every action drags Sheogorath's holy name through the mud. For Sheogorath's glory. Nah, sacrifice yourself on the altar of despair in order to let to, to light the flame of Agnon. I now I can now receive the flame in the courtyard.
Hold on. flame of Agnon, the fire of inspiration and rapture. If you light the great torch on the mania side of the Sasellum, you will be a hero to the people of Bliss, I assure you. I knew I saw the glint of true mania in your eyes, my child. Go now and let the holy flame inspire the people of Bliss to new heights of madness. Hello. The poison of the elytra can be debilitated. Oh, hello, Shio. Aren't you off to a good start? That's important. For me. Really, your work is going to save me a lot of time. Maybe time. The Grey March is upon us, and the ordering begins. Armies of order sweep my realm. Death, destruction. Then I have to pick up the pieces. And there are always... Lots of pieces. I don't like it, having to rebuild my realm every era. Sometimes I forget where things go, like New Sheath. I can never remember where it belongs. You'll change that. Break the cycle. You'll stop Jigalag, and I'll have my realm to come back to. I've never actually tried that before. Why not? Something has to work! Once, I dug a pit and filled it with clouds. Or was it clowns? It doesn't matter. It didn't slow them down. To be honest, it wasn't the best idea. And it really began to smell! <gasps> Must have been clowns. Clouds don't smell bad. They taste of butter. And tears. But this... Is all new! A fresh idea! Something I hadn't thought of. Until I did. It sure to work, even though it might not. What now? Now? You'll need the respect of my citizens. They'll need a leader, someone to look up to when I'm gone. They're the backbone of any great land. Except where the backbone... He's an actual backbone. Ever been to Malakoth's realm? Oh, nasty stuff. But back to the business at hand. You'll need to control one of the carts of madness. Replace a current duke. Or duchess. Whichever. That will command respect. The people will rally around you. You'll have their love, their admiration, their complaints. Whatever as long as it keeps them on our side. No. <laughs> no, no, no. Absolutely not. Well, yes, absolutely. Bit of a shame for them. But sometimes you need to break a few eggs or skulls. There are rules, though, even in the Isles. Rituals and rules. You need to follow them. Speak to Artis and Ervenen, the high priest at the Sasellum Arden Sul. They can explain what needs to be done. And you've always got our man Haskell to call on for help. Faithful, like a good hound, that one. And he looks better in a suit.
Ta, come visit again. Or I'll pluck out your eyes. <laughs> Another sheep returns to the flock. All right. Oh. Oh. What, uh, what am I doing? Okay, which one is... Okay, so I want the Duke of Mania. Um, anyways, since I'm leaning towards Mania anyways this playthrough, um, yeah, anyways, guys, uh, yeah, I'll end the episode there. Um, as a matter of fact, let me save it before I do. Um, but yeah, if you did enjoy this episode, guys, make sure to leave a like and uh, comment your thoughts. Subscribe to the channel, join the Discord, all that fun stuff. I'll catch you all in the next one. Bye, guys.